This is Otobek Kurbanov, a farmer from the Horezm region of Uzbekistan. He is one of the country's most successful farmers, but now his land is dying. Otobek's once fertile land is parched from the lack of water. His dream is to breathe new life into his land again. For centuries, civilizations grew and flourished in the basin of the Amudarya, the largest river in Central Asia. Today, managing scarce water resources has become a critical challenge for Uzbekistan. Only 9% of water resources originate within the country, highlighting its transboundary water dependency. The western and northern parts of the country, with 11.3 million inhabitants, depend on the Amudarya. Uzbekistan is highly vulnerable to the impact of climate change. Over the past century, average temperatures have increased by 1.6 degrees centigrade and are predicted to increase up to 3 degrees higher by 2050. Climate change will result in more variability of inflows to the country and changes in the timing of peak water flows. This will certainly impact agriculture. A major factor contributing to the crisis of water resources in Uzbekistan today is outdated and deteriorated irrigation and drainage systems, which cost the country $1.7 billion annually from lost production. Currently, irrigation systems cannot meet the requirements of high-value cropping, which requires a reliable delivery of irrigation water. To address this challenge, the Asian Development Bank is proposing a project to deliver climate-adaptive solutions for water resource management. The project would modernize outdated irrigation and drainage systems within the Amudarya and selected reaches of the Zarafshan irrigation system. Amudarya Havzastan all netkan suning altmish poize bunkunda dalagi itibar mohta. Buning asosiy sababi usha yunalishlagi tarmoq larning gidratini inshaat larning tamir talab falatki kilp kolgan lega. Bunkunda ushbu inshaat larne tamir lash tiklash vari konstruksiyalar talab itil mohta. Fermer xujaliga va boshka sudan foydalan uchilarne bunkunda suti joch teknologiyan jara kilp sudan samarale va aqlana foydalanish buyuch ularne bilim va tajribalarne oshirish talab itilar. About 68% of irrigated land is planted with cotton and wheat. These crops are highly water consumptive and have low productivity. Firma kujaligimizni yer maydonini unumdorligi yuqorida bajaradi. Agar bizga irkin qishloq xo'jalik ikinlarni ishga ruxsat bo'lsa, hamma ekin turlarida, masalan, paxtachilik, g'allachilik, poliz, sabzavot va boshqa ekin turlarida yuqori hosil olishimiz mumkin. Shu yilda biz paxtachilikda tomchilab sug'orishni amalga oshirib, ferma xo'jaliklar o'rtasidagi suv ta'minchiligini bartaraf qildik. Without waiting for more water to restore his land, Otabek Kurbanov decided to use laser leveling to prepare his fields. This simple yet effective technique resulted in more efficient water use. ADB will continue to support Uzbekistan to modernize irrigation and drainage systems to provide more reliable and efficient delivery of water for agriculture. ADB will also support capacity building for farmers and local water resources specialists to develop innovative ideas and good practices. This is essential to support the shift from low value and high water consuming crops to more productive, high value cropping. Sustainable agriculture is a key factor to spur economic development, achieve food security, and the future prosperity of Uzbekistan.